Now, that's kind of the long way to do it, but if you want to shorten down the time significantly, you're going to want to buy a hole saw. That's this thing right here. And you're going to want to make sure that you get a diamond dust hole saw. there you have a pair of jawbone knuckles. Now these are for a lady, so the holes are a little bit smaller, so it doesn't quite fit me. But I've got another pair here that does. And there's a question that I know a lot of you are asking. Does it work? Like, is it just for show or will it actually tear something up? Let's find out. <laughs> so this is Ned. And, sorry Ned, I'm not usually this violent, but here we go. Ooh. Yeah, that looked like it hurt. Almost done, Ned. I don't think Ned survived that one. I hate papayas. <clears throat> oh yeah. <laughs> Dragon fruit. So no one volunteered to test, let me test this out on them, so there's your proof though, it can do some damage. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that. A couple last minute things. Um, to do the initial cut where you're cutting the knuckles out of the jaw, um, if you don't have a scroll saw, that's okay. A diamond dust wheel actually works better than that. Um, to cut it out just because some of those teeth can be super hard to cut through um, I'll lead a, leave a link to this as well as the um, Hole saw in the description so you can find those and the hole saw that I used was a three-quarters inch hole saw um, That's kind of a starting point uh, Most people's fingers are going to be a little bit larger than that, but that's going to remove most of the material So then you can go from there um, but it's actually not that hard to make as you saw it does take a little bit of time but I mean it's super cool but hey don't take my word for it go try it yourself hey guys thanks again for watching I just wanted to give a shout out and thank you to Thomas Doc Nutter he left a five-star review on my Facebook page and he said an inspiration indeed thank you for sharing via social media you Rick. I think he meant to say you rock. I'll take it either way, but thanks again, Thomas, for leaving the review. And also wanted to say thanks to a couple people who commented on my videos. Um, BTC Gilroy, Fish Hunt Wyoming, Haley Maynard, uh, and Kaylee Nickenbacher all left comments this past week or two. So thanks again for leaving a comment. Um, please consider subscribing or hit me up on Instagram or Facebook. I'll leave links to that below. But again, thanks for watching. I hope you learned something.